Let's talk about the electrical energy and electrical power. This is the index that we are going to see about the electric energy first, electric power and watt meter. So if I is the current flows through a conductor of resistance R in time t, then the quantity of charge is given by Q is equal to I into T. If the charge Q flows through two points having a potential difference of V, then work done in moving the charge is given by V into Q since Q is equal to I into T, so V into I T. So electric power is defined as the rate of or doing electrical works. So V into I into T divided by T is equal to V into I. So electric power is the product of a potential difference and the current strength. So electrical energy is defined as the capacity to do work. Its unit is Joule. In practice, the electrical energy is measured by Watt Ha or kilowatt ha. One kilowatt ha is known as one unit of electric energy. So one kilowatt ha is equal to thousand watt ha is thousand into three thousand six hundred joule. So it's thirty six into one hundred five joule. Sorry, it's ten power five joule. Because we got three zeros here and two zeros here, it's ten power five joule. A yeah, watt meter is an experiment or it's, it's used to measure the electrical power consume, consumption. And this is an instrument which I am trying to show it here. This is a watt meter. So by definition, a watt meter is an instrument used to measure electrical power consumed. The energy absorbed in unit time by a circuit. So watt meter consists of a movable coil arranged between a pair of fixed coils in the form of a solenoid. A pointer is attached to the mobile coil. The free end of the pointer moves over a surplus scale. When current flows through the coil, the deflection of the pointer is directly proportional to the power. 